I'm braving the blazing Arizona heat to check out a local gem that's been getting all of the buzz. Barrio Taco Shop, right here on the street. Sure, it's hot enough to fry an egg on the sidewalk, but that's not stopping me. Today, we're gonna check out this taco shop that all these influencers have staked their reputation on, saying it's one of the best in town. So, we're gonna go check it out. It's actually located right in front of this fruit shop here. As you can see, it says nuts. And it's right along the street with a lot of traffic and a lot of sound. Hopefully, this video won't be terrible. Before we do that, make sure you subscribe to me and turn on notifications so you don't miss out on any more content from me in the future. All right, let's head on all that way and we can check out his tacos. We're also gonna take a look at the menu just so you know what is on there. The menu is actually pretty simple. It's 100 degrees out here, so this menu, it's going to have to knock it out of the park. Let's dive into the menu at Barrio Taco Shop. They kept it simple with just two main options, tacos and nachos. For the tacos, you got three meats to choose from, carne asada, al pastor, and cabeza. One of the standout toppings is the pineapple, adding a sweet twist to the mix. Every taco comes topped with onions and cilantro, keeping it true to classic street food. Today, we're trying the carne asada, al pastor, and the cabeza taco. Of course, we did not forget the drinks. It is, after all, the desert here in Arizona. So what am I gonna get? I am going to get a delicious, refreshing limeade. And of course, the standard horchata. When you're in a 100 degree weather, that looks amazing. Mm. Okay, so right here we have the al pastor. Take a look at this taco here. This is one little but full taco. I don't know if you can see that here. Just bring that a little closer. Yeah, you see that? Oh yeah, look at that. Really nice. I do like how the pineapples match the Alpha Star, but we're gonna hit it with some lime juice real quick and see if that changes the flavor a bit. The lime juice is a must. We'll wash it down with, with some horchata. All right, so there's so many cars going by right now. All right. Next is the carne asada. I'm gonna take a closer look right here. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah. Look at that. All right. Let's just take a bite of this. That's some good carne asada. Very meaty. Like where the flavor. There's a little hard flavor in there. It's kind of fatty. I love carne asada that has a little fat in it. This makes it so much more juicier. I like that this taco is not breaking apart on me. But I almost feel like there's too much tortilla here. A lot of tortilla to be chewing. But nevertheless, it's better than uh, the taco falling apart. So we have the cabeza, which is basically the beef cheeks braised. There's definitely a different flavor to this cabeza taco. I'm trying to decide if I like it or not. Uh, this is a little iffy. I don't know, maybe it's the sauce or maybe it's the meat itself, but I don't know if I like it or not. I'm still gonna eat it. Maybe it will counteract that flavor that's inherently in this uh, beef cheeks taco. And let's try it again. It still has that taste. Even the lime and the sauce couldn't get rid of it. I'm gonna have to give that cabeza number three, the third place. It's just, it's a hit or miss. And right now it's a little bit missing for me. in this nachos here. Look at that. Pineapple, alpha sour, guac, sour cream. Let's check this out. Ooh, and cheese. Duh. Of course it's gonna be cheese. I don't know if you can see this here. Look at that. Oh. Chip has a little bit of everything. I love that the chips are uh, kind of thick, a crispy, a little chewy too. Mm. 
not like those flimsy chips. So if you're looking for a quick meal, you can head to Baseline. Barrio Taco Shop is here along the street. If you're coming during the summer, you definitely need some drinks because it's uh, freaking hot.